My name is Shalonda Patron. I am the Junior User Support Analyst here at SA Health. My example is a co-worker called me over to her desk to show me something. And before she can get through her entire statement of what she wanted to tell me and show me, I interrupted her and went into my own observation. Of course, the conversation did not end on a good note. We both were a little frustrated at the end of it. So then later on, I used the tool of healthy venting and I kind of talked through the situation with someone and when I did that I was able to realize that I wasn't being really receptive and respectful of her and what she was trying to show me and using that tool because a healthy venting is not about what anybody did wrong is about understanding the situation so that I can move forward and, and have a good relationship with my co-worker so then I was able to work through that process and then talk to her and get on better terms. <laughs> I do like that everyone's included in the process. I like it because then everybody gets the same. The culture is about everybody that's included. It's not just management. It's not just staff. It's not just one team. So if everyone is included in the process, then we all can share in that culture together. And that makes communication easier and better between everybody in, in the organization. Having a common language has been beneficial because then again everybody's on that same plane and then it allows us to work together better and we have the same tools having that it helps us understand the intent of the other person it takes a lot of the guesswork out of what is this person trying to tell me or how can I talk to this person so when someone starts in the tool or goes to something you know where they're coming from and you can understand them better the most challenging value for me was being straightforward. So straightforwardness was very, very difficult. I really, I value relationships and I thought that being straightforward would come off as being rude or arrogant, but <clears throat> in evaluating and understanding things better, I know that being straightforward is being respectful of that other person and being able to kind of communicate with them better <clears throat> and it builds a better relationship so being straightforward has been the hardest one for me but it's, it's been it's been good it's worked out because then I'm able to easily communicate what it is that I want and it builds trust within the team if we're able to truly say what we want and go forward I think any company that's considering life work should really give it a chance and really understand that it means that you, what you're communicating to your organization and the staff, your team, is that you care about the culture, you care about the communication. Um, it's more than just, okay, in order to do your job, here's the pen, here's the pencil, here's the computer to do so. Here are tools so that we can all work cohesively together. So I think you should go for it. <laughs> that coming in, I think in the beginning people don't understand it. And so you really have to believe in it. You have to accept that the information that's being shared, the tool that's being shared really do work. They really do help communication between everyone within the team and the organization. Um, it's not just a follow the leader type thing. And it, in the end, creates a more productive environment because everybody can be more relaxed and trusting of each other. I wish everyone in ESSA would do this because it allows everyone to have tools that allow us uh, to communicate better. I believe that the teams are more productive because of the increased and improved communication that we've been able to experience with the LifeWork systems. From my mentoring section, sessions, I get an opportunity to kind of talk about my fears and how I can develop as a person and what type of tools and I can use and, and processes I can use within the LifeWork system. And then the training sessions, I get to kind of share that with other people and to share my experiences and to kind of help make connections for them as my mentor is making the connections for me. So it, the full circle process helps you understand it better and apply it 
across the board? I do believe that trustworthiness is a true need. So kind of going back to the other question about the difference between the departments, there was a lack of trust in the other department in that I believe what made a big difference between the two. So you are able to communicate better with your coworkers, your manager, with everybody around you if you trust them. And not trusting the people who you're around while you're at work all day makes a, for a hard work day. I just, I kind of came in and got to see the end result of where everything kind of was and was able to work to get myself there so that I can be on the same page with the group. Oh. <laughs> it's improved both work and at home because I'm in a more trusting and open environment. Then my work life is almost easier, even if there is a situation where one of our co a coworker and, my, and I walk away from a conversation and we're frustrated I can easily work it out. I can easily think through and get back to where we're on a good page. We have a good relationship. And because everything at work is so much better, it translates into home. I'm not going home and talking about negative situations or not being happy and having to recap everything that's happened throughout the day. I can just go home and enjoy life with my family and my husband doesn't have to hear bunch of stories. <laughs>